Hello, we're thinking here back with another episode of War on the Sea. It is the 9th of February, and we have three Blenheims going out against a lone destroyer. I don't know where he came from. He's just outside of Palembang, and he's uh, he's skirting around the area. I thought he was just going to leave, so I didn't attack him, but then he kept hanging around, so I thought maybe he's a scout for a larger task force. So we're to see if we can do a little skip bombing and take him out. I thought maybe I would do 50 meters with these guys, but it looks like that is like way too far. I'm going to go ahead and run into 25 meters, and we're going to make a run on this guy here. Probably going to lose some blenums. I don't think uh, <clears throat> this is the best idea I've ever had, but we're going to go for it. We're going to go for it. We are going to go for it. I'm assuming skip bombing works the same as high level bombing as far as targeting, so. He is trying to turn into us. Which is why is it him? I hear the small caliber guns going. And we're going to go ahead and drop. Alright, here we go. There they go what we get. Somebody is hurt already. Oh well. That, that worked. <laughs> wasn't what I, it wasn't a skip bomb. But, oh, and I lost a Blenheim. Down goes a Blenheim. Well, maybe. Definitely wasn't a skip bombing. That was quote unquote low level bombing. <laughs> Tactical bombing. That. Oh well. I should have dropped them sooner for the skip bomb, but, uh... Oh, I should just let them do the attack around themselves. They got some hits. Worth it? Probably not. I don't really care about destroyers. I, don't, I won't get points from it, so... It was, uh... Pretty much a waste, yeah. Let's not let them crash into the island, please. That'd be ideal. So, yeah, that was a waste, but, uh... I thought it would be a nice intro to the... To the episode, have a nice little attack on this DD. He might, uh, he might get additional damage from the fires. We'll see. All right, ended up with moderate and minor, and I got tired of waiting for that. I flew out from Batavia and checked this out. And there's nobody there. I literally, must have been a. They must have spotted a sub or something, and uh, and thought it was. DDs or something. I don't know. Literally nobody there. I could launch again from Batavia and see, but uh, even if it's only DEs, I don't really care. Oh, and we lost Benjamison. Um, gone. He gone. So, yeah. I'm going to bring him on up, and he's going to patrol this straight here. The Sunda Strait. Just come on up there, buddy. I have to reorganize his uh, scouts a little bit. All right, we got sight on somebody else. It's the same little DE, same little DE. I could go in with the hurricane and try to strafe him, but I don't think it's worth it. We're gonna lose this Palembang if I can't get some troops up there. I got the Task Force uh, Twenty One on their way, but man, it's gonna take forever to get there. So, not sure. Uh, if we're gonna get there in time, yeah, it's gonna take 148 hours. <laughs> oh my God. That's a long time. That's a long time. So yeah, not looking uh, good for Palembang. Singapore, strangely, it's fine right now. Strangely fine. I think something might have been a little buggy with the with the game. They were supposed to take Singapore, but maybe not buggy. Maybe I'm just that awesome. They were supposed to take Singapore at the beginning, and I was supposed to take it back. But instead, they didn't. They took all of these islands. <laughs> uh, but uh, I've, I've maintained all of these southern islands, southern and, and western islands. So, but yeah, we'll see what happens. You know what I might do? I might bring Task Force 3 here on up to um, Batavia. They've got a thousand troops there. I might just bring them, pick up just a few of those troops and bring them up to Palembang. 
and see if we can help. Now they won't have enough supplies to support all those troops because they only have 190 supplies here. <laughs> but uh, hopefully we can help a little. I don't know. I don't know if that's a good idea or not. Rob Peter to pay Paula, so to speak. And we found somebody. Okay. Interesting. A CL, it says. Okay. Somehow he slipped past this task force here. Or he might have just came down this way. That's uh, completely feasible. Let's uh, can keep the sub coming up this way. The Exeter is coming up here to grab some troops and stuff. Then we'll go over here to meet them. I might just send somebody out to say hi. Uh, probably not a PBY, though. Probably not a PBY. Especially if it is truly a uh, like cruiser let's just do uh, the Hudson's bring them down <clears throat> see if they can watch him keep an eye on him oh he's coming back the other way okay interesting interesting okay oh no he's just circling around it okay well, what he's doing we'll keep I'll try to keep an eye on him There he is. Okay. Let's begin. With the Hudsons, we can at least uh, do a little smashing. Alright, what we got? Alright, we got uh, one light cruiser. All of Japanese light cruisers look the same to me. So I am going to just go around here. I know they have some different gun emplacements, but uh, largely I didn't. All right, so we'll just do that, and we'll just do this while we get up to our target height. And I'll see you guys in just a moment. All right, we are here. I'm going to go ahead and drop just a little bit late. Kind of on purpose. Maybe not really. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I didn't do it right. Hold on. There we go. Now they're dropping. Okay. We are getting some small arms fire from the cruiser, so we're going to break away there. The second group is going to come in here. They are still a little ways away, so we should have enough time to... Take a look. Now, he's not really doing any evasive maneuvers, I noticed. So I didn't want to curse it by, uh, by doing too much commentary out on the approach. So, <laughs> hopefully these will all be a positive drop. And, uh, hopefully all in the front. That's what I'm planning. We'll see what happens. Did all four together instead of two, uh, two groups of two. <laughs> Complete and utter misses. Wow. Bro, that was terrible. Okay, well, that's fine. Now nah, he's definitely going to make evasive maneuvers. That was that was some bad manual bombing. Okay, that's okay. You win some, you lose some. I'm sure I'll get hits with these guys because I'm going to be more careful. Alright. He's still not really making any maneuvers strangely he's turning very slightly to the left but it's largely running trip running true all right let's see what we can get this time see if i can get right on the target mark this time that's where i do my best work <laughs> imagine that Okay, here we go. Five and six dropping. Turning left, scooting out. Let's do it. Come on, baby. Drop them. These are high explosive bombs. There we go. That's, right. That's pretty good. Won't complain about that. 
minor damage. Wow. What is the armor on this guy? Interesting. Let's take a look. Just right quick at who this truly is. Here. Who is this little fella? Nagara. It's Nagara. Yeah. That is her. Alright, so let's just take a look at her statistics here. Uh, deck armor only 1.5. That's interesting. Bridge 1.5, superstructure 0. Yeah, so it didn't have much in the way of armor, but I don't know. I guess the bombs just couldn't handle it. Just couldn't handle it. Let's take a look at the Blenheim right quick. I mean the Hudson. Uh, 500 pound, only 0.7 armor penetrating. Okay. That makes sense then. That makes sense. But does it make dollars? Yeah, it makes dollars. Alright, so he escaped with minor injury there. Very good uh, for him. We're going to go ahead and bring out the Dookies. We'll bring out these Dorniers and have them say hello as well. Don't have any 139s in the area. So, um, we'll just keep this guy down here in the spot for us while he's got fuel. Dimbasar, he's got a PBY. I'm not going to waste him on. Uh, what happened there? Stopped. Weird. Um, an encounter with Singapore. Great. Uh-oh, cargo ships. They're coming for the, uh, they're coming for the invasion. Okay. Here I was just bragging about no invasion. Alright, we want HE bombs for the cargo ships. Definitely want to get the cargo ships out. So we're going to bring them up. 139s. You got an hour. Can you make it before they do? I don't think so. Ball and bong. You're going to launch also the Blenums. Yep. Also with HE bombs. It's a CL with them. I could try to sink that CL with uh, semi armor piercing bombs. Let's, let's just bring them. Hopefully, we can get up there in time. Hopefully, we get up there in time. Alright. There they go. Dornier's down here looking around. Hudson, what are you doing? Start looking around for the light cruiser. Although this is really my primary concern. We're not going to be able to stop him from doing that invasion. Yeah. He's going to drop a bunch of stuff. Well, Pooh Bear. Scoo Bear, Pooh Bear. Who, who, who bear. The invasion of Singapore has begun in earnest. February 10th. Oh my god, stop him! Stop them! Get those plenums up there and we'll, we'll do this engagement. Be nice if I could replace the planes up here. And I ignore it just until I get those plenums up there. And. Engage. Alright. Here we go. Time to stop the invasion of Singapore. Oh, we got this little, little buffalo as well. Well, he can do some. Uh... Oh my god! Are you kidding me right now? Holy cow. So four cargo ships, the rest are destroyers. Well, those destroyers themselves will be able to carry a lot of stuff. But I'm not going to focus on them. I'm going to focus on these um, <clears throat> four cargo ships. And I may do... One 139 and a Blenheim. And then one 139 and two bottoms. 
That's what, maybe what I do. Okay, we're just going to break these guys up. Okay. Actually, you know what? Go ahead and form up first <clears throat> for your climbing. Alright. And I'm going to need you too, buddy. I'm going to do some strafing. You can just hang out right where you're at right now. Alright, Blenheims. Go ahead and form up and uh, line ahead there, buddy boy. Alright. I don't I don't know if I should just focus down on like two ships or if I should try to drop one on every ship. If I drop one on every ship, I have a possibility of greatly diminishing the troops and supplies that they have on board. Especially if I get a nice big hit with the 139s. 139s, one bomb might even sink them. It's a big bomb. Uh, the Blenheims, not so much. I probably should focus all... Now I'm thinking about it. I probably should focus all three Blenheims on one cargo ship. And that's probably what I'm going to do. Okay. I wish I knew how much cargo these guys had on board. Which one I should target. But unlike the TTE mod, does not show on the does not show here which was a huge improvement I think where's the one that looks like a tanker that's him Sakamaru hmm. we're gonna bring these guys here, I guess we're gonna target number nine. So Sakamaru. He's uh, he's almost in position, but I'm gonna go ahead and slow him down. They are in line ahead already. Yep. By the time they get to the target, they should be high enough. 139s, go ahead and come on over here as well. And now I'll, I'll break them up when they get there. All right. Hopefully I'm not making a bad decision here. But it doesn't matter. Uh, do what I can, regardless. Sure wish I had a submarine up here. With some rock pickings. Although with all these destroyers, <laughs> they're gonna drop a lot of troops regardless. They're gonna drop a lot of troops regardless. Maybe I should just do that and just load up on destroyers for troops and supplies and rush them up here. That's that's a that's a plan. That I can do. I certainly could. Alright, 139, let's go ahead and slow it down. And go ahead and circle. Mostly because I don't want to have to worry about. Yeah, go ahead. Go this way. Right, but I want you to separate, don't I? you to break and I want you to head on over here this guy yeah, that guy you guys are going for the Osaka Maru here unfortunately I brought armor piercing with these guys so I thought I was gonna be going after a cruiser or at least a light cruiser He's turning. He's slowing down. He's down to four knots. I'm trying to make me overshoot or something. All right, let's, let's swing wide a little bit. Now right, here we go. Don't let him fake us out here. Alright, here we go. Are you ready? Drop. Not quite exactly right, but... Do what we can. Go ahead and just go straight. Yeah, he's, he's pretty much idle. So... 
freaking invasion force. That's pretty good hits, regardless. Okay. 139. The old thing. He's running straight so far. So I believe in you. Oh my god. I screwed that up. Alright, you're gonna have to go for another target. Trick that. Trick that. Screw that up. Alright, break. Get out. Okay. Alright, I got control of this guy. Come on, sorry. So let's go ahead and... <laughs> I don't know what happened. I think I had my my hands on their own keys. Okay. You think I know where WASD is by, the, by this time? Uh, I really just want to just... jink it over just a little bit. But I think I'll just go with what we got. Drop. Scoot out. Uh, Probably just scoot out this way. Right. Hopefully this 139 can he might swing back around this way actually. Get that guy back here. Number 10. Yeah. Alright, let's see how we do with this guy. Number four. Singapore invasion force. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, that was painful. So close. I knew I should've I knew I should have moved just a little to the side. I knew it. But I didn't do it. So it doesn't matter what I knew. It doesn't matter what I knew because I didn't do it didn't do it so it doesn't matter all right well we're gonna get this Osaka Maru back here and see and take her out okay here we go no fooling this time no fooling me this this, this was a completely unsuccessful raid I tell you what Completely unsuccessful. Well, I mean, not completely unsuccessful, but they successfully dodged us enough that their invasion will be successful. That makes sense. Alright. Don't be cocky. Drop right on the dot. Right on the dot, my friend. Right there. Do it. All right, well, the buffalo is not going to be doing any strafing, that's for sure. He might strafe one of these damaged ships. He'll get killed for sure. The Blenums are the only ones that did any real work. 139s, nah. They're fired. Fired. Well, that was a good hit size of that bomb, that should be a destructive moderate, moderate, oh heavy, heavy, okay <laughs> I was going to say moderate, moderate what? alright, so he's on heavy, heavy, he's got several fires, the other guy's on moderate, moderate he's got one fire one fire at least going um, so 9 and 10 both heavily damaged but overall they will still be able to have a successful invasion I'm afraid. Uh, let's go ahead and bring the 130, the uh, buffalo down and uh, he might just have a little bit of fun, I don't know. <clears throat> he might come in strafe number nine, see if we can finish him off. Probably lose the buffalo, but uh, he does have some bombs, doesn't he? No, he doesn't. No bombs. He had some bombs at some point. <laughs> Oh, number nine got his fires out. So I'm thinking I might do a little strafing of number nine here. But unfortunately, 
this uh, number one destroyer is coming to help. So, I don't like that very much. One slower down, Johnny. Come in for your strafing run, slow it down. And then brake hard to the right. caliber machine gun or anything. Not gonna do much anyway. Oh he's got he's got uh, 50 calories. Okay. Still. Just one plane. Not gonna do a lot. Alright so we'll see what uh, what happens with the uh, number 10 here. The number nine's fine. Number nine, what did she get down to? Moderate, moderate. Okay. Wow. How disappointing. That means Singapore is now in danger for sure. Alright, got a good secondary explosion. Still a heavy heavy though. And she sunk. She sunk. Number 10 sunk. All right, well, that's um, that's pretty satisfying that we at least got one sink out of the whole thing. I wish we got more damage. Um, no CPs, of course. You don't get CPs for these worthless cargo ships. <laughs> it's ridiculous. <laughs> that's what wins the war. <laughs> it's <the> logistics. <laughs> anyway, whatever. Okay, so, so yeah, Singapore is about to get invaded. I, I got nothing in here in Singapore, so that's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. Yeah, an encounter with Singapore, you think? Did they turn back? God, I hope they turn back. Nope, they didn't. They didn't. Enemy troops have landed. Now it's not. It's not terrible. It's not terrible. Two CAs. Holy cow. Oh boy. Oh boy. You keep an eye on those, my friend. Oh, you can't. You're worthless. Can we get uh, one hurricane up. No bombs. Watch these guys. What? Where are you? Where'd you come from? One CA, two DDs. Dirty dogs. Dirty dogs. Come on down there. Truant. Trusty. What are you doing? It's Truant. Okay. Um, Exeter. Are you close enough to manage cargo? No, not yet. Go ahead and get up in there. Uh, why don't you stay here and watch that guy, please? And let's see if Exeter can now load up troops. Nah, not yet. Wow. Well, he's not going to load up troops anyway. Bomb and bomb is ready to launch aircraft again. I don't even know if it's worth it to go after those guys up there now because they already dropped. So I'm thinking we might come up here and see if we can find wherever that guy was. I've forgotten now where he was. So 
Yeah. Pretty crappy. Pretty, pretty, pretty crappy. Alright, so now let's see if Exeter's group can manage cargo. They can? Good. So they've got 227 troops and 200 supplies here. So let's just go ahead and grab 200 of those supplies and we'll grab some troops as well. Enfasar is in pretty good shape. Palombong, not so much. So we're going to run with Exeter. this way just like that all right and that's going to be it for this episode next episode we'll attack this ca or whatever's down here it's probably that light cruiser again and then i guess we'll send some guys either up take out these uh, cargo ships maybe i don't know i don't know that it's worth doing because i don't get points for it and uh so and they, they've got so many that it's not going to make a big difference. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, hit that like button. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.